Good evening, Giant fans, and welcome to the Giants' fourth annual town hall here at the Beacon Theater, presented by New York Presbyterian, the number one hospital in the New York area, and of course, the proud sponsor of the Legacy Club and MetLife Stadium. I'm Bob Popple, along with two-time Super Bowl champion David Deal. You guys ready for a little fun tonight? As always, we'd like to introduce our first guest this evening to talk about the 2018 season coming up and the state of the organization. The president and CEO of the New York football giants, Mr. John Mara. I've said for many years, you know, I'm 63 years old now. I've been around this team all my life, been through the good years, the bad years, and there's no more loyal fan base uh, in all of sports than the New York Giants fans. I just want to say uh, how much I appreciate not only all of you being here tonight, but the loyalty and the support that you've shown uh, over the years. It makes uh, uh, coming to work every day uh, a, a pleasure. So thank you all very much. We appreciate you. I'd like to introduce the new head coach of your New York Giants, head coach Pat Shermer. Our game is about the players and it's about the fans. And so we're certainly appreciative of everything you do. And I assure you that we're doing everything behind the scenes to put a team on the field that you're going to be very proud of. The Giants have an entire new coaching staff in 2018. So it is with great pleasure we welcome in the new defensive coordinator of the New York football Giants, James Betcher, and the offensive coordinator, Mike Shula. Thanks, all right. Good. The thing I can tell our fans, and I can tell you that you're going to see from our guys, you're going to see guys are going to play relentlessly. So they're going to be after the ball. We're going to swarm the football. We're going to play hard. We're going to play smart, fast, and physical in no particular order, in no order of importance. All those are the three core ingredients to playing good defense in this league. Hi, my name is Jack from New York City, and how are you going to use Saquon Barkley? <laughs> Hopefully a lot. <laughs> As you can imagine, we're very excited to have Saquon here. He's, uh, he's very physical. Um, he can catch the ball. He's not, he's not going to be a guy that you can just, that you're just going to put back there in the eye formation and, and just let him run the ball, though we will do that. We'll, uh, we'll be able to move him around a little bit, um, and we're looking forward to doing a lot of things, and I think that he's really going to help us, help our offense, and uh, help other players on our offense, and, and in turn, they're going to help him be a better player as well. Ladies and gentlemen, the 2018 New York Football Giants. I got a question for Saquon Barkley. Transitioning from Penn State to the New York Football Giants, what, what has the transition, transitioning been? Have you gotten more reps out of the backfield? Have they put you at different positions you're maybe not used to? No, I would say um, that I got to give a lot of credit to my coaches in college um, of preparing me um, for, for the NFL and um, being able to learn to try to become a versatile back and uh, to be able to play out slot, play out wide, play out the backfield, um, do whatever it takes to help the team win. And um, that's helped me so far in OTAs. Obviously, I have a lot, lot more to learn. You know, for when I first came on my visit, I they took me into the cafeteria. <laughs> of course, they took me into the cafeteria right away, right? And uh, I saw Eli Manning in there. He was he was eating, and I, I was just I was just like, wow, like that's Eli Manning. <laughs> and and then I and then I thought to myself, I'm like, whoa, you know what? You might be blocking for him shortly. I was really excited about the young guys. You know, they seem like uh, they're so excited to be Giants. You know, and that's what really got me excited. Ladies and gentlemen, Eli Manning. Just talk about your attitude going into this year. Uh, well, well, obviously, Coach, uh, Coach Shermer said it best. I'm the, I have the best body of a 37-year-old he's ever seen. <laughs> Alec, um, Sort of your impressions of being a New York Giant. The tradition of linebacker here is is top notch, the best in the league, best throughout the league. You know, so you know, for me, for me to get an opportunity to come be a part of that, and, and you know, I definitely look forward to the opportunity. You know, getting to play with these guys, and, 
you know, I got a lot of respect for each man that's sitting up here today. And, and uh, like I said, it's exciting for me for sure. Landon, uh, obviously, new scheme with Coach Betcher. Um, just talk a little bit about some of the things that you've learned about it and what you like about it. Um, I like that we, we take we blitz almost five people every time. I know Eli doesn't like it because he can't pick up the uh, the blocking scheme, but uh, it's awesome. Uh, I <laughs> Shots fired early, you know. <laughs> Go ahead. My question is for Nate. You have been blocking for uh, one of the best quarterbacks of all time in Tom Brady. How does how does that differ? Um, from blocking for the most elite quarterback in the NFL right now. There you go. There you go. He just, he just makes a lot more plays behind me than Tom did, that's all. Uh, thanks for your question. I, I'm just so excited to be here, like I said. You guys are awesome. <laughs> that wraps up the program. Thank you for coming. Thank you for your loyalty. And we look forward to a great season. Have a good night, everybody.